Here we're going to find the exact value for the six trigonometric functions in a given angle theta. We've got a diagram here, angle theta. The opposite side from the angle is length 3, and the adjacent side is length 6. We can use the Pythagorean theorem to find the length of the hypotenuse. If we do that, we'll find that the hypotenuse has length 3 times the square root of 5. When we know all three sides, we can find the values of our trig functions. Start with the sine, or that the sine of theta is equal to the opposite side over the hypotenuse, so that will be 3 divided by 3 root 5. And if we simplify that, we'll get the square root of 5 divided by 5. For cosine theta, and the cosine of an angle is the adjacent side over the hypotenuse, so we'll get 6 divided by 3 times the square root of 5. If we clean that up, we'll get 2 times the square root of 5 divided by 5. The tangent of theta is equal to the opposite side over the adjacent side, so that will be 3 divided by 6, which is equal to 1 half. The cosecant of theta, the cosecant of theta will equal the hypotenuse divided by the opposite side, so we'll have 3 times the square root of 5 divided by 3, which is equal to the square root of 5. The secant of theta is equal to the hypotenuse divided by the adjacent side. We'll have 3 times the square root of 5 divided by 6, which is equal to the square root of 5 divided by 2. The cotangent of theta Cotangent of theta will be the adjacent side over the opposite side. So we'll get 6 divided by 3, which is equal to 2. And so we have our six trigonometric function values.